Hi guys, so in today's video I will be talking about the new Doom, more specifically about uh, the Ancient Gods expansion. You see, um, I'm one of the fans that uh, didn't really like Ancient Gods like most people. And I'll tell you just why. And no, this has nothing to do with uh, the guns or whatever. It has to do with uh, the lore actually. You see, in classic Doom, hell, even in Doom 3, you are a marine. So you're just a no. You're just an ordinary marine who is pitted against the forces of hell and from the start you know that you're just a man. You have no powers. Of course you have uh, uh, demonic relics and somehow you are able to harness them and you can easily say that uh, somehow the divine or god uh, is helping you and uh, you are doing the will of God in a sense, since uh, the demons took everything and you were the last survivor. Now, the plot of uh, the first Doom, I mean, of the classic series, and I said Doom 3 is very simple. You were just a man, and you're against the demons, and you are. and you. And you're a good guy, and uh, oh shit! <laughs> As I said, you're a good guy, and uh, and there isn't and the morality is set uh, right uh, from start said right from the start so you know who are the good guys who are the bad guys but uh, uh, the new doom doom eternal and its expansion packs totally throw that out of the window so they do it by making the angels uh, by making the angels the bad guys because you know we uh, associate light with everything that is good and darkness with everything that uh, is evil so uh, in ancient gods they make angels like this uh, like this uh, corrupt beings and uh, they actually They actually start to <laughs> they actually start to humanize the devil. They start to humanize the devil in Doom because we we find out that uh, we find out actually that uh, the creator of this universe in which we are playing is actually the devil or devil and. Uh, in Christianity, uh, devil the devil is actually a fallen angel. So, <laughs> see what I'm talking about. They make the the light evil, and they make the dark seem not necessarily good, but uh, it uh, humanizes it. You know when. Uh, when when I was playing uh, uh, the ancient gods when I was playing the ancient gods I was actually expecting I was actually expecting that they would, uh, will turn out to be uh, I don't know something uh, like uh, the icon of sin but uh, you know even meaner 
even uglier. But no, what they gave us uh, was a butt naked doom guy. And it's even worse because in game uh, they bought the. Uh, they bought. They bought actually. <laughs> Of course, I'm not really focusing <laughs> at playing the game. I'm more focusing at making a video because you know I'm tired of uh, of doing edits, so I rather have a video made with uh, how I play this game. Okay, so where was I? Oh yeah. So uh, they gave us that boat with a bad naked doom guy. And not only that, uh, we find out apparently that uh, that Devot's true appearance is that of uh, of uh, of Doom of Doom guy, and Doom guy uh, has his uh, superpowers from uh, you know, yeah, the devil. So, if you think about it, in the, in the old Doom series, you are actually on the good side, and you even had uh, in Doom Three, you even had you even had a thing called the um, uh, what was it name? The Soul Cube, which was actually uh, a relic containing the souls of Martians, which we could interpret as some sort of uh, version of. Uh, uh, ancestors of ours in the Doom series. And uh, the ancient gods and the new Doom totally throw those established concepts out of the window. Especially when you think about it, that the new Doom is actually a sequel to the classic series. So in terms of lore, they reversed everything we we are a, a demigod made in devil's image in the image of the devil we are no longer just a typical marine who is held by the divine force no we are made in the image of, of the devil and don't get me started because uh, the lore in the new Doom really sucks. Like, uh, like if you read the codexes in Ancient Gods, they really spoil. <laughs> they really, sp they really spoil everything. As you go and you fight your way, you will already know the story. <laughs> So yeah, I'm really... So yeah, I can say I'm really disappointed because... I don't like the duration we have taken with the new Doom series. I mean, yeah, you can even say that uh, Doom 3 maybe had uh, a sucky gameplay, but at least in terms of universe in terms of aesthetics the themes they remain true to the classic series and you know what i find it um, really weird is the fact that they tried to make uh, the new Doom more like, uh, or so I heard they already had that idea to make uh, uh, the new Doom like a brutal Doom. 
But you know what's funny? Even in Eternal, where they uh, put where they put a lot of story and they put so many cutscenes, and they even made uh, they even made uh, they even made Doom Guy speak, and yet they still couldn't uh, capture his personality from the classic series. Hell, even this. Uh, mode, this brutality do mode makes uh, Doom Guy more appealing. He has also a nice uh, voice actor. He, he he speaks only when needed during the gameplay and it really works and I really love uh, the models of soldiers uh, in this mode. The models of soldiers. So yeah. <laughs> It's really sad when you think about it, because when I look at uh, this brutality mode, this is exactly how Doom Eternal and the Ancient Gods series um, should have been. Anyways guys, uh, thank you for watching this video, it was just a little rant. Because the Doom series really lost uh, its sense or its meaning for me. And uh, I can see why they won't want a new Doom to make because they really uh, ran out of ideas. Maybe make, maybe they will make comics uh, as prequels, yeah, but I, they really block themselves in a corner by making by making doom guy and they were related uh, to one another I, I like <laughs> like like I, I don't really understand why they even did that I mean it's not really in doom it's like uh, like I of I've noticed this uh, in uh, media in general uh, uh, for some time or I noticed that uh, uh, they they started to uh, humanize evil to make you empathize with it and it's really it's really bad because doing it for doom it just ruins it. I mean, sure, yeah. Uh, I mean, sure, yeah. The ancient gods have uh, have uh, the ancient gods. Uh, Doom Eternal have great music, uh, uh, great gameplay. I'm not denying that, but uh, it really has taken out uh, what made Doom Doom. In terms of themes and uh, goals of the character, because in classic Doom, demons don't fear you. You ain't a demigod, and nobody gives you praise. You're just a survivor uh, with revenge in his heart. So yeah, I wish you a happy day. Goodbye to everyone.